Andrew Cuomo's got to go. He's got to resign because a third woman has come out with a very troubling story about him. This is basically the third woman in a week to come out with a story about Andrew Cuomo and his misdeeds personally against them. First was Lindsey Boyland, and then there was Charlotte Bennett. Both of them were basically ex-aides of the governor, but now there's a third woman, Anna Rausch, who's come out and basically said that Cuomo did something similar to me, and I want to read you this. It says here, according to a Monday report from the New York Times, a third woman has accused Governor Andrew Cuomo of inappropriate behavior. The story tells the account of Anna Rush, now 33, who claims she met the governor at a September 2019 wedding reception. Rush said that Cuomo placed his hand on her bare lower back, and when she removed his hand with hers, remarked that she seemed quote unquote aggressive and put his hands on her cheeks and asked if he could kiss her. And here's the thing, like I believe Bennett and I believe Boyland, but we have a picture here. This picture here is of that moment. You can see it, Cuomo sort of towering over this young woman, you know, with his, his, his hands on her cheeks, basically sort of teasing her, sort of trying to maybe flirt with this far too young for him woman, basically joking off the discomfort and embarrassment and awkwardness she felt in that moment. That was him using power, power as governor, power as somebody older, power as a man to basically try and get his way with this young lady. Look, is this the worst accusation a politician has ever faced? No. But when you combine it with all the other things and with the story from Boylan and with the story from Bennett, he must resign. He must go. And that's on top of what he did to Ron Kim, what he did to people in the nursing homes, his lies around COVID, all of these things. He must resign. It's over. It should be 100% done for Andrew Cuomo. I don't give a damn about the political ramifications. He has a fundamental disrespect for people around him and for people in his state. At a political and a personal level, no one's life matters but Cuomo's life to Cuomo. And that's why he's got to go. And look, the Democrats, you can find another Democrat. The states run to the, to the hilt with Democrats. But that means you have the responsibility to get rid of him. All of these people that talked about Trump and all of these people that talked about how, you know, we need to really ensure that we have leaders that respect people, that respect women. Now's your time to prove that you weren't just using it for politics, but that you meant it. Get rid of Cuomo. His fundamental disrespect for women and for people that were vulnerable is disqualifying as anyone that wants to lead a party that supposedly believes in justice and equality.